All right, so you got $50. That's your cap. That's the only thing you can spend on your self-improvement or getting better at something. What would I spend $50 on? Here it is. Super important to me, my self-education. So the first thing I would spend my money on if I had $50 or less is I'd go get an Audible account. Like straight up, I would get the highest tier of Audible account and I would get the audiobooks that I need. So if I'm trying to start my own music business, I would go buy music business books that I can listen to on tape. Um, I'm not in any way affiliated with audible.com, but it's been something that I absolutely love because I don't read a lot, but I'm always like, I'll go on a jog up the street and I got my book in, you know, and I've just learned so much over the years by listening to audiobooks. I think it's such a great tool to learn on the go. So anytime I'm not in the studio, I'm not working on records, etc. I might be in the car even, I'll listen to Audible books. And the reason being is because I can just scale my business and my learning and my skills while I'm just doing other stuff. And I think it's one of the most highly underrated tools in the world. Um, even if you have under a thousand dollars to spend, a thousand dollars is a cap, right? I would spend it on your own self improvement, on developing new skills, learning new things, connecting with new money, with new networks. That is 100% the best investment you can possibly make. Um, I think a lot of people get ahead of themselves and they're like, I got 50 grand, I'm gonna go, you know, invest in real estate and I'm gonna buy all this stuff. But the problem with that is, is that if you're not a big Big enough person if you don't have the skills if you don't know what you're doing you've never been through it you're probably gonna spend that fifty thousand dollars and realize you have a lot of other things you'll have to manage to be able to keep that fifty thousand dollar investment or even double it or get any money from it so the best investment you can make is in yourself 100 it's something that can never be taken away from you i've invested a lot of money over the years like the last decade i've spent millions of dollars on myself learning, uh, going to school, getting a degree in sound, audio books, seminars, business uh, conferences, you name it, uh, mixwiththemasters.com, you know, just learning everything I possibly can because it's the quickest way to get what you want. So if you want to learn more and you want to like have this rapid pace growth, invest in yourself. And we offer a lot of cool things to help you get there. Like we have a uh, vocal mixing masterclass, the advanced vocal mixing masterclass, beat mixing masterclass. I've done a Facebook ads course. You can check all this stuff out by clicking the link in the bio and just start spending money on you. That's the best investment you can possibly make. It's an investment that's guaranteed to return. But if I have 50 bucks or less, I will go get an Audible account and I'd binge some books straight up. Hope you guys like this tip of the day. If you did, share it with some friends. Drop a like, comment, you know, show some love. All right, have a good one.